Okay. Here we are. Here we are, Fallout 76, finally, on this fine Saturday morning. I'm going into this with some pretty mundane expectations. I expect to be able to explore a Fallout world and do some fallout -y kind of things, but I'm not expecting it to be Fallout 5, so I should be in pretty good shape. I'm pretty much okay with, you know, if it's bizarre and broken, because that could lead to good and interesting things. I'm not, I'm not coming into this thinking that, you know, this is the greatest game of all time, and that's what my expectation should be. But who knows, we'll find out. this great nation accepted that armed conflict was the only way to preserve our rights to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. If our founding fathers could only see us now. From Antietam to Amiens, Okinawa to Anchorage, we have fought. And now, the Red Menace is at our doorstep. Democracy itself is under threat of annihilation. That is why today, July 4th, 2076, 300 years after our great nation began, we gather together to honor the completion of Vault 76. This sprawling underground shelter may have been engineered by Vault Tech, but it was built by you the good people of America, so that if the bombs do come, if the end does come, our way of life will endure. But not everyone will be saved. Those chosen to enter this vault must be our best and our brightest. For when the fighting is stopped and the fallout has settled, you must rebuild. Not just walls, not just buildings, but hearts and minds, and ultimately, America itself. So as we stand here today, we pray that the world will know peace. But if that is not our destiny, if war must come, we stand together knowing that here in Vault 76, our future begins. Okay, well, that was pretty good. Cool. Morning, Vault 76. This is the Overseer. I hope you all enjoyed the party last night, even those who may have overindulged and overslept. But it's time to get up and get out there. We've been locked away long enough. Okay, this is going to be. Today play. is Reclamation Day. It may be time to leave, but I'll never forget the day you all entered Vault 76. You come from every walk of life, every race, color, and creed. 
but you all share one very important trait. You are this country's best and brightest. But more importantly, you'll always be my family. Okay. Let's take a little bit of a time warp here where I can try and work this out how I'm going to look. Okay, my first real issue here, other than the fact that you, I really can't make it perfectly look like me, which is just so hard to do anyway, but um, you can't change your, your beard to a different color than your hair, which is really annoying because, I'll be perfectly honest with you, mine does not match. Not, even before with the gray, it was brown hair, black beard. No, that has nothing to do with the Black Knight name, but that, that's a whole other story. Let's see, what else can we do here? Okay, can you see anything happening here? I, mean, I don't know what that does. Not a clue. Alright, apparently you can change this anytime you want, so I think we we fooled around with this. It's close enough for Jazz. Back. Uh, oh, here, body. Let's... We can have fun with this. Not really. <laughs> not as not as much adjustment as you would think, but yeah. There you go. I think that'll work for right now. What are extras? Damage. Why would he be damaged already? He's been in the vault. The night fights and the uh Yeah, I guess you can have whatever you want, so that's a good thing. Well, you want to call it good for now? Name your character. Ah, uh, let's go with a standard name. I won't go Black Knight. Where do you think I should go Black Knight? Why would he be the Black Knight? That doesn't make any sense from a roleplay perspective. That's something you'll earn later. Although, this is a multiplayer thing. Here's what we'll do. That was how I was pretty much known freelancer. It's, it's a contraction. It's a, it's an, an acronym. But uh, we'll go with that. For right now. I'm sure you can change everything later. If not, oh well. Ooh, okay. Take a photo. Move the mouse. Okay, what happened to me? Um, hello? I'm gone. Uh, reset. I'm... Hello? Um... Oh, what the hell? Ah! Whoa. Okay, this is... That was somewhat annoying. Alright, I think that's as close as it will let us get. Take snapshot. Okay. Okay, so add access photo mode. So here we are. You can turn the light on. Can't pick anything up. Um, that's my backpack. Shouldn't I grab that? Golf clubs? Golf clubs might be useful. Have a great day. Good evening. Good morning. I have no idea what time it is, so we're good. No idea what time it is, but let's see. There's alarm clock. Okay, get my glasses. Okay, at least take my... I can't take my glass. Can I take the hat? Okay, that's cool. Does it still work? Yeah, there we go. That still works. Okay, I can play guitar.
Okay, how long do you have to play to get a bonus? Plus, that came out a lot heavier than I thought it did on the sliders, didn't it? Yeah. Okay, is that enough? Well tuned. Oh, well, close enough. Can we interact with anything here? Can I take the Robo Fun? No? It's all just decorative? Okay, happy Reclamation Day. Today is the day, everyone. Reclamation Day. We've been preparing for this moment for 25 years. We're ready. You're ready. America's waiting for us. So let's get out there. All right. That's a that's a great message for one of the most momentous things in history, as far as you're concerned. You're invited. 10 p.m. to midnight. Everybody's going to get drunk. And the party hats. Play holiday. Nuka Tapper. Okay, how does it work? Okay, this is this is a, this old beer tapper. Okay, come on. How do you? Oh uh, yeah, let's just well, let's just let's exit. Good game, yes. Eject it. Let's take that with us. At least we have one thing we can take with us, and it's the root beer tapper game. No, that's there's no ambulances in the fall universe. That's in that's here. Guess it doesn't really matter if I leave the lights on. All right. Is this junk we can take? No. This is painful. This is a lot of metal and cloth and all kinds of stuff I'm going to need, and I can't take any of it. Please? You can activate the dryer. Server not responding. Controls have been temporarily disabled. Disconnected from server just for trying to use the dryer? This doesn't bode well. Okay, yeah, that's... Hey, at least I'm still me. Alright, that's... A little heavier than I intended, but I'll take it. Yeah, I've been lifting a lot or something. Or eating a lot of hamburgers. I don't know. Not a small guy, anyway. What's more deadly than being hit by a sledgehammer? Being hit by a sledgehammer has a rocket strapped to it. Behold the design philosophy of the super sledge. Yeah, it's nothing new there. Okay, do we have to go through the whole thing again? Skip. Good morning, Vault 76. Um, we, we did this. This is the Overseer. I hope you all enjoyed the party last night, even those who may have overindulged and overslept. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. What happened? But it's time to get up and get out there. I have to We've do this again? Away long enough. What happened? Today what happened to my face? Reclamation day. I spent 15, 20 minutes making that, and it now it's over? It time to leave, but I'll never forget the day you all entered Vault 76. You gotta you be from kidding me. Every walk of life, every race, color, and creed. But you all share one very important trait. You are this country's best. Where's and my face? Finest. But more importantly, you'll always be my family. Oh, this is. Okay, that's really annoying. Name your. Um Okay. 
Okay, exit. Can I load? Is there a, a character to load screen here? What can I... How do I... Oh, that's totally annoying. Z menu. Oh, shit, dude. I can hear you. <laughs> oh, no kidding. What's up, man? Not much. I just created a whole character, and then as soon as I, I went to... face disappeared when you were trying to take a picture for no, your no, ID? That's not my problem. I went and I activated the dryer, and it dumped me out of the server, and I lost all of my changes. Oh. <laughs> like, I literally spent 20 minutes trying to do this, and it's all gone. So now you can just remake the face later. I'd wait. This is going to be buggy at launch. It may be buggy for a very, very, very long time. Did you play, uh, like, Conan Exiles? No, no. But, yeah. I mean, Bethesda's a much better company. They'll figure this shit out, but... Uh, let's hope. Um... I'm gonna I'm gonna hop out and then hop back in and see if it reload which one it loads. Cool. Okay, talk to you. Good luck. I'll it talk won't. to you later. It will. See you, man. How the hell do I even do that? Let's. Here we go. See, you, have a good one, guys. All right. First of all, that's gonna be really annoying if I'm broadcasting to everybody. Play. Gary, no, I don't. I don't want Gary. I don't. All right, let's see. So it saved the one I didn't want. Because I'm not Gary. That's just a joke. Okay, maybe it won't matter. Let's see. Let's skip. Good morning, Vault 76. This is the Overseer. I hope you all enjoyed the party last night. Even those who may have overindulged and overslept. But it's time to get up and get out there. We've been locked away long enough. Okay, let's just go with Today that. Today is Reclamation Day. It may be time to leave, but I'll never forget the day you all entered Vault 76. You come from every walk of life, every race, color, and creed. But you all share one very important trait. You are this country's best and brightest. But more importantly, you'll always be my family. Can we take a shower? Uh. Okay, that's deep, but so I can't change the field of view? Truly first person only? Uh, nice touch. I can't get any first aid. I should really bring some first aid. This is great. I wonder if anyone can hear me now. Okay, 
Okay, the, the bonus isn't working anymore. This is, uh, okay, here we go. Quest started, reclamation day. Now can I grab stuff? Still can't take anything, like some food. Could sit on the couch. Right here we have our annual vault Halloween costume contest. Okay. Outstanding achievement award. An appreciation for your commitment and dedication to our isolation program. Sacrificing many so some can live. I'm not sure I want that award. That sounds really excellence in bravery and recognition of the in recognition of the canned? Oh, no, I zoom in here. Mystery. In recognition of the canned mystery meat experiment, you volunteered to eat when no one else would. We're proud of you and glad you are not dead. Okay. <laughs> best looking hair? Well, I mean, I have the best looking hair. Now it's Cleanest Toilet Award. <laughs> Performance Award. Vault. Hall Monitor. My eyes aren't good enough for that, folks. Alright, anything else we've been through here? Nothing to do but open the door. You have been tasked with nothing less than the rebuilding okay. of America. Such a huge responsibility. Just know that Vault Tech is proud of you. I am proud of you. When you hear this, it means I've been gone for several hours. I've got my own mission out there in Appalachia. This is the Overseer, signing off. Discover the Overseer's mission. Sealed vault door, okay. Got nothing. Coffee machine activated. Did I get coffee? Let's make some noise. pretty solidly in a certain direction. There's a weight room. Each standout has gear for you to pick up and use. Lots 
lots of water out there, almost all of it undoubtedly irradiated. When in doubt, boil it out. Okay. I don't know that boiling water gets rid of radiation. It doesn't seem like that's the right, uh... If you get injured, and you will get injured, <laughs> make use of stim packs. They are literal lifesavers. Be on constant alert for the clickety-click of your pimp boy's built-in radiation meter. Anything in the trick now? So, about the infrastructure out there in Appalachia, I suspect there isn't any. <laughs> it must be terrifying leaving this warm, secure vault for a hostile wilderness with no running water or electricity. Okay, well at least they give you some junk to start out with. I've got no weapons. No creature comforts out there, sir. You want it, you build it. <laughs> excess. What's excess adhesive? Some leftover stuff? Maintenance. Can't go past there. of a party last night, eh, sir? Good to see you all together one last time. Drunk, joyous, and not staving off a horrible death minute by minute. <laughs> okay. Okay, so they've got some stuff built in that will be very useful. Okay, Overseer, that's where we, we want to go. Haha, we have to discover the Overseer's mission. Can we loot the Overseer's office? Oh, wow, that's a nice view out the window, Overseer. Vault Tech with Report. 25 years after the vault doors close, you are to prepare your citizens to leave Vault 76 and to begin a pro process called Reclamation. Specifics will be disseminated automatically as that time approaches. From where? And built into the, the code? Or? Someone talking to us. After Reclamation Day, you are personally ordered to find and secure three nuclear silos. Codenamed Alpha, Bravo, and Charlie. If these sites are still nuclear capable, ensure no one except Vaultec can access or launch nuclear ordnance. To be clear, even if there are other authorities, whether government, militia, or otherwise, their claims are to be ignored. Which means you probably have to shoot them. Vaultec alone maintains. How the heck does Vaultec maintain jurisdiction over uh, jurisdiction over nuclear weapon? That's kind of. Baltech is 76 one of the most important projects that his Baltech has completed. No expenses have been spared on building, staffing, selecting. You're all wonderful. The special classes and instruction you received don't apply to this assignment. Vault 76 is special. Your mission is to see to the livelihood and well-being of all your residents and make sure they are ready to colonize America once the all players receive. It is expected you will face challenges and there's not much information there. Operation procedures, day-to-day -day duties. Your job as overseer is to see the overall health and safety of Vault 76. Avoid loss of life at all costs. The Vault residents have been carefully chosen for their unique skills and temperament. Due to the aptitude of Vault residents, you may be presented with unique challenges in maintaining order. As a last resort, each domicile can be locked down and the resident imprisoned for any duration you deem appropriate. And for solitary confinement can lead to psychological issues, so factor that in. Don't drive people crazy. 
Although the vault doors cannot be opened from the inside, keep the, the entry clear of all unauthorized personnel. The security team will stow all weapons and munitions after the amended entry period and will be armed solely with non-lethal devices. Well, where can, does that mean there's some guns here? If America's to be rebuilt, every life in this vault must special preserve them all. Okay. Mandatory shutdown. Our studies have shown that even after a relatively short duration of living within the amenities of Vault Tech, that the test subjects can grow to depend on them. That will not do for Vault 76. After the all-clear message is received, Vault 76 will shut down all functions inside of 24 hours. Great! Air circulation will cease last, and you should warn the vaults residents that staying inside of the vault can be lethal after this period. Everyone must leave the nest. It's imperative that all residents are focused on the important job of rebuilding America, so we're taking away any point of safety for you. Great. Archive files. Reclamation date has arrived. We counted down to midnight. I haven't seen every one material like that since Vault Baby Number One was born. I called lights out a couple hours ago. Had to get security to help a few people to their beds. That was probably me. Then the volunteers and I got all the standees set up, just like we practiced. Need to get, make the final recordings, and then it'll be time to have that door. I wish I could be there to help everyone on their way, but I know they'll make me proud. Survival first. As instructed, we set up the survival packages. I have advised everyone to run fast and far from 76 as soon as the door opens. Why? We have no information about what awaits us. Walt Tech says we're America's best hope. Now we'll find out. Annual review. At current count, six residents are under disciplinary lockdown. That's up from four last year. The morale officer has managed to quash the worst rumors about Appalachia. Cannibal mutants, burning rain, whatever. But tensions are high. It's generally pretty easy to maintain order. The pedigree of most of the residents is impressive, to say the least. So apparently I'm awesome. But competence sometimes means arrogance. Uh, yeah, that's true. That, that you'll have this. And arrogance means my authority gets tested more often than it should. Hydroponics have been struggling to keep up with demand. I've been loath to institute mandatory rationing, but in 2101 that may be necessary. 76 is full to bursting with people, more than we anticipated. Top successes. The award ceremonies are a great way of stroking the most hardened egos, which is why I have those silly ass awards, since everyone's so damn competitive. The low point was when someone losing a tooth in a fight over the best dental hygiene award. Alright, that's funny. The senior staff has been exemplary as always, very dependable and loyal, and a struggle to keep our over-achiever, overachievers placated, but another year down we're still here. Vault 76 World Cup has proven to be a huge hit. The ball damn near broke the jukebox, but the energy in the atrium is just amazing. Alright. Deleted files. No files found. Well, they didn't delete any, I guess. But how cool. Overseer's log, or should I say, direct communication. Because whoever is listening to this had the moxie to try to find out where I've gone. But I'm glad you did. Truth is, I need your help. I've been given a task and I've decided to break protocol and tell you what it is. Because if there's one thing I've learned in these past few years, it's that we need to rely on each other. There were three active nuclear silos in Appalachia before the bombs fell. They blew up the world before. We can't let it happen again. So we've got to locate and secure all of the silos. Or die trying. Hopefully the former. <laughs> but it's been 25 years. I just don't know what we're gonna find out there. Or where to start. My directive was to go to the nearest population center and assess the situation. I'll set up a camp on the way once I get my bearings. Find me there. Okay, so we got it. Um, how I escape out? Tab? If you say load, do you have to load? I still have it in my... Okay, I still have it. So, the overseer is doing some vault and dirty work kind of stuff. What's in this door? 
not even a door. Okay. You must all go through that giant vault door alone. Survival and rebuilding, so use it often. Okay. A Z once you're in the wilderness. All right. Um, let's see inventory. Apparel. Oh, the party hat. Does that give you anything? Style points, I guess. No, no defense. It goes with the man bun, though, I guess. I don't know. It's... Ooh, movies. Except your newer, harsher surroundings, scavenge weapons and items. At least that's what can I do to build a better world. Build in designator, so you can't build anywhere? Okay, I think we're back around. Get a job. Black rim glasses. Okay, well, at least get that pen. Perk cards. Okay. What perk cards did I get? What makes you special? Oh, here we go. That looks pretty good. Let's see, what would be the best one? 40% chance to find extra first aid chems when you search a chem container? Okay, well. Alright, I'll come back. Action boy. I, tell you, I, I think in Lead Belly might be the best thing to, to go for right now. Short term. Strength 2, Perception 1, Endurance. I didn't get to pick any of these. So you just start out with, you know. Never stop learning. door that works. Go that way. Alright. Oh, here we go. Gotta say, it's very Fallout 4. Blinding light, and here we are. Still know how have no idea how I'm going to change my face the way I wanted it to be because I'm just a default guy. The region surrounding Vault 96 is known as the forest to the survivors of Appalachia. Of whom we will find none. Why <laughs> making their bobby pins on Oh that's a different thing. Tumblers today, okay. I'm a level two. Which means nobody can shoot at me. 
which is a good thing. So I'm completely unarmed. Completely unarmed. There was there were no weapons in that place. That's a bad thing. Loading for a while. First contact, find the overseer. Okay, now it should be classic fallout from this point as far as moving around. Can you get back in? Hello? Find the overseer's camp. Okay, what the responder corpse? Okay, those are. Okay. Which means they probably were using it. Okay, we got. Um, uh oh. Propaganda flyer. Yeah, I'm sure we got it for this. Rebuilding the future for a broken nation. Is that like from the Chinese? Okay, now I'm out of bullets. Come here. I can punch robots. I am Magnus, robot fighter. Okay, so we punched out some robots. We have to punch out more robots. I don't want to keep reading the propaganda, I just want to... Important. Responder corpse, a machete, and a combat knife. Okay, well, let's equip one of those. Level one, mediocre condition, damage 17. We'll use this for now because it probably will look cooler. Let's, let's look at that. Oh heck, what's this? Another one? 
I don't know that that was much better than punching him out. I'm getting fusions though. That's that's good. Back up the way we came, I think. But Ooh. flowers, soot flower. Pennington. The overseer said she'd set up her camp down the road to the south. You should head to that camp. Find the overseer. The overseer's camp is where you need to go. Um, All right, that's a little bit. Have fun rebuilding America. Okay. Over to Dendron. Orders from Maria Chavez. Paul, I need you to make the monthly scouting run on Vol 76. Those doors have to open sometime. Don't take risks. Observe for two days and come back. That didn't, uh, didn't work well. Another machete. They break, so. Alright. Everything I've seen online says follow the main quest or you're kind of screwed. The only way you can get set up with enough stuff to survive. Okay. I'm not gonna say how come with these uh, we don't see any of these in the future because they just don't do very well. Assume follow this little path. Take everything I can find. Ooh, possible. Kill a creature. Where'd he go? We need some opossum meat. As a matter of fact, let's eat that currently. a little bit hot. I have some rads now. Hmm. I feel like eating a little hot opossum. <coughs> what the? Who's lazing me? Don't know what you can do with a soot flower, but we'll figure that out when we're in a more stable place. I say this, I mean, for 25 years after the Great War, I don't think it would make sense for it all to look this good. I mean, look at how Boston looks. You know, a couple hundred years later, you'd expect, um, what the hell is that? It's a protectron, but is it friendly? We can find out. Let me go down here around the road. Like I almost expect after a couple hundred years things to have recovered more like this. You know, right now we should be just out of the nuclear winter. Protectron cuts down trees, but does not require much or laboratory facilities. Additional wood samples are unavailable at this time. Okay, so if I come back, I can get wood for them. Plus lumberjack protectron equals desirable wood product. Where are those bugs? A bee swarm. 
How do I fight a beast swarm? Stay away from beast swarm. I hate these. Let's just go. Can we sprint? I, mean, I realized, you know, Fallout logic, I should be able just to punch the beast worm, and that's, that's good enough. To the south. We're supposed to keep working our way to the south. Find her camp. Here's a camp. Is this... This doesn't look like it's... This means somebody set up camp here, and they're not here anymore. Oh, yeah, that's not good. Where is the road again? That was on. That's the east. South is straight ahead. What the? Petrified corpse. That's from the war, I take it? Like this person. What was that? Oh dear. Okay, we have. Ghouls of a scorch. I prefer scorch. Oh, this isn't good. I'm like halfway dead. And people are shooting at me. Can I retreat? Who's shooting at me from that side? I'm surrounded? We'll attack the projectron. <laughs> Nothing wrong. Oh dear. You know, I think we may need to use the gun. How come these guys are like, you know, zombies? <laughs> Gotta reload. I'm almost dead. out of bullets. That's just useless. Now I'm being attacked by bees. <laughs> run away. This is definitely a good case for run away. Um, items, machete. I don't know if I have to swap the bees. The fact that it doesn't stop time when you, uh... Disease chance? Great. Okay. So I've got some health back. Now here's an interesting question. Let's say I wanted just to, to leave the game now. How the heck do you even do that? And where will you end up? Does it drop you right back where you started? Is it... All right, let's let's do this. Okay, that first contact. Will give me a aha. So I don't have to find it completely on my own. It'll give me a point. Not go near the house. No, this is bad. Didn't mean to trespass. Let's just, you know, all stay calm. Bypass anything that's going on here. Obviously, my character, in, if I was completely role playing, this would be like, what the heck was that? As a seasoned fallout player, sports turn can surprise me. Okay, so we kind of round. Oh, recipes and plans. I wonder what the next recipe is. Be 
Is that Interstate 80? 38. What did it say? Let's see. Where, uh, 88. Okay. So we cross the water and then the camp should be there. Ventress is now wanted. Are there other people in the game with me? I mean, I haven't seen anybody. But I just got a solo server. Oh, he's hanging out at the... Okay, um, no, that's legendary super mutant skirmisher. I'm a little bit inadequate for this. That's all there is to it. Can you hear me, Fulgrim? Ah, thanks for the help. Much appreciated. I think this will be a good place to pick up later. Fulgrim, I gotta take off. But, uh, thanks a lot for all your help. How does one even do that? Menu. Okay. Click to desktop. Okay, as you can see, I've come back to a place that's a little bit more familiar. And some place where I can just talk with you without lots of people listening as we go along wondering if I'm talking to them. We're, this is between you and I. You know, this is... What I don't get is here. You're looking at Boston. This is 200 years after the war. And nothing's alive. Now, I realize there are radiation storms and things like that that come up from, you know, basically from the... Uh, the site of the nuclear detonation, but they were there were nuclear detonations in Appalachia. There are petrified people that look like they, you know they're victims from Mount Vesuvius, where they were turned to stone, turned to solid carbon from the blast, which should have completely annihilated everything around them. So it doesn't make sense that they were burned that badly, and everything else kind of looks fine. And you could say, well, maybe all the trees were killed, and then in 25 years grew back. Well, then why haven't they grown back here? I mean. Surely there would be some kind of radiation storms and things like that going on in Appalachia. I mean, unless I mean, unless you want to say the glowing sea was you know the result of a direct hit on a nuclear power plant or something like that, right? That makes more sense. Maybe nothing like that happened in Appalachia. Maybe they were able to recover, you know, more completely. But even so, 25 years later, that little area looks pretty good. Maybe it's special. Uh, we'll find out later on when we look at the other areas. Um, still. I have a feeling this is, you know, I'm not going to try and rush through this game. This isn't going to be like, there's enough playthroughs out there. Um, I'm going to I'm gonna continue to play Fallout 4, because Fallout 4, I still have a lot to do with Fallout 4. When I feel like uh, an online experience and something new and different going on like that, I'll, I'll do that. And we'll see. You know, I'm not, I'm not blown away by 76. It feels just like 4 for the most part. Um, it's a little bit harder because you can't stop time. I'm getting a little bit of a preview of my latest build here. Eventually I will have a video just about this place. But, I mean, you know, it, it's a funny thing. I have a feeling I'll still have, for the short term, probably more fun in Fallout 4 because I've, I've leveled everything and I've built so much. Uh, I've heard that, you, you know, your, your settlements aren't permanent in, uh, 
in 76. You have to build them every time. You get to keep all the parts, but you have to reassemble everything wherever you are. It's not like you can just plop down a whole settlement. I don't know if that's true yet. I guess we'll figure out once I can build something. Um, so, hey, we had our first interaction, you know, with a guy who was wanted. So, I don't know if he wanted me to kill him. I wasn't going to kill him. Um, I don't think I could. Actually, I, I was pretty safe there because I was, le was sub-level 5, so he couldn't do anything with me. But still, it's it's an interesting thing is that it's extremely Fallout 4. I mean, it, it feels exactly the same, looks exactly the same. It, it's a different environment. There's prettier trees, but I mean, it still looks like Fallout 4. I mean, you can't... That's part of the reason I'm doing this is you can compare the two. I mean, it doesn't really look that much different. I don't know. I'm, I'm disappointed about the... I've seen my first glitch already. I didn't even get out of the vault. So, it could be could be interesting times ahead for this game. Um, like I said, I'm not going to turn this into a Fallout 76 channel. You're still going to see a lot of... It's, I, I put up whatever I'm playing. And, you know, for right now, I'm, I'm good with Fallout 76. I'm going to give it a bit of a break. I've got, I've got family coming in. My wife's family's coming in for a week anyway. So, I'm going to be real busy and all that kind of stuff. It might be a little bit before I can game in any sense. Maybe I could idle GTA 5 overnight and just build up stuff in my, my nightclub and do stuff like that. But, I mean, you know, it's probably going to be a bit busy for a little bit. But, uh, yeah. But there you have it. Fallout 76. It's, in, it's, it's Fallout 4 online, as far as I can tell. And it's, that's not a bad thing. Um, I'm not blown away like, oh my goodness, it's Fallout 76. But I'm also not like, this is the worst game ever. I'm, I'm neutral on it. It's like Fallout 4. That's a good thing. I like Fallout 4. So we'll see how it feels, how it plays. Um, I know that it's it's going to be a different way to uh, to get to the lore. You know, and that, that it's going to be a problem. I could be reading a screen and hear someone say, Hey, quit reading the screen and you're annoying me. I mean, that that's going to be a problem. So I may we may have to do these videos a little bit differently than we would Fallout 4. I might have to be more quiet. You know, maybe some of them won't have any voiceover because, you know... You'll only hear my voice when I'm talking to someone. It might be... Yeah, it might be more realistic in some ways, you know? It will be more immersive because I won't talk. And then I'll only talk if I'm talking to someone. Would that, would that work for you guys? Would, you know, would losing the... Uh, losing the communication between us be an issue? Would you prefer just watching you know, me go through and interact with the game as if you were you know, going along with an actual character? I don't know, that might work better. Maybe we'll use Fallout 4 for the uh, the times when I want to talk to you guys and in Fallout 76 when I'm talking to them. I don't know. you got to figure it all out at some point. But on this note, this is uh, your Black Knight. And I, I have to say, I have a slight headache. so I don't, and That happened before I started the game, so I'm a little bit flat today. But uh, This is your Black Knight. I mean, we'll, we'll do some more 76. We'll be doing some more 4. Doing some other, other games as well. Probably not doing Red Dead Redemption 2, so don't get your hopes up there. I have not bought it, I'm not gonna buy it. Don't feel it. if I ever get struck by the need to be a cowboy and you know enjoy the dynamic horse testicles of Red Dead Redemption 2, then we'll 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 go with that. Then you know, but uh, for, the, for the time being, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night. Okay, so I guess I guess we just have a cow on the roof now. That's like a thing. <laughs>